The ABC to VLE project launched in October 2018 at UCL. Clive and Natasha greet colleagues arriving from near and far. Fiona Strawbridge, head of UCL's digital education team, welcomes everyone. Project manager Jessica Gramp explains the organization details. And Clive introduces the project. And the idea was to think just simply about this. If we've got a design here that we've done as a part of our ABC, how do we get that into our learning environment? That's what we'll be talking about today. Many of the participants are already using ABC. But for others, it's a new and exciting approach. So here are the numbers. Here are the numbers, like 34 faculties, 7,000 academic staff, and 70,000 students. So these are the part of the users we are helping in our work. We have 8,000 8, 8, ordinary students plus 2,000 distant learning students as well. We used it as part of an introduction to learning design session, short, hour-long session for new tutors at the university. But we expect um, to start real innovation uh, in the coming year, where people really start to use the new functions of the Canvas LMS. Uh, and that's where we expect to uh, start using the ABC workshops in a large scale also. We did the first uh, workshop in English. And uh, then the second uh, workshop uh, we did in French by the moment that we had already translated all the, all the cards and the sources in French. It's part of a teacher training for newly appointed teachers. Um, and the context there, these are individual teachers. It's multidisciplinary because they are, these teachers come from different faculties. After that uh, two workshops, uh, we started run with different disciplines, different levels, so from uh, a degree to a master degree to a postgraduate course. One thing I have to say about this, the materials, they're really amazing. So we've experimented with laminating some of the cards and posters and have found that especially in really nice. Our expectations right now what we see is that they use some technology in face-to-face -face meeting. When it gets online, it's lost. So we want to mix it up a bit. And the value of the two-day event? The most important part of the meeting is the sharing of ideas and intense discussions. I get to smoke today, so I'm really happy. Um, and the things I remember is firstly uh, the fact that so many people are already uh, running the ABC workshop and see the added value of it. Uh, and the other thing is the fact what what's the main challenge is the follow-up. How to make teachers uh, implement the plans they um, have considered during the workshop. But the most important thing for me was meeting the partners to see how is everybody doing, have they tried ABC before and what are they going to do when they get back home and implement the project. The two or three points that I take away from today, well the first one is networking. The, the fact that we're all face to face together is incredibly valuable. Um, and I find that uh, you can't put money on that. The second point I would look towards uh, the fact of, of clearing up any misunderstandings that may be, identifying your personal requirements that you have to do or your institution's requirements. It's very, very clear to have that in a face-to-face environment. It's, uh, it's, it's great to be here um, and to meet lots of partners from European universities to share how ABC has been used, how they're using it, to think about how it can be better used, especially in academic development contexts, to help support other members of staff in uh, de designing, developing really good modules and programs. The next face-to-face -face meeting is in Zagreb later in 2019. If you would like to find out more, follow us on Twitter and visit the website.